Greetings, it is I, the Smile of Madness. And today, after a long hiatus of laziness and playing way too much Team Fortress 2, we are finally going to finish this bloody game. And oh my god. Obviously a malfunction. Because it's a malfunction. That's a good question, actually. I don't know. I forget. I've not played this in a long time. Oh my god! And he's in the cell that Sonic was in. You can tell by the writing on the wall once we actually see it. Oh my god. What's that? That vibration? The cannon. Oh my god, it's Rouge. What the hell are you doing here? You, you haven't given up yet? It's all over for us. Why? What do you mean? I just received a message from my boss. What boss? The space colony arc is currently approaching the Earth at an incredible velocity. Say what? It probably will impact Earth. Say what? Oh shit. That's not good. Well, as long as it hits New Jersey, it's good. This is a dead sentence for every human being on Earth. If my calculations are correct, the space colony arc will impact the Earth in 27 minutes and 53 seconds. And the Arabs are like, why Allah? With your beloved planet Earth. Why have you forsaken us? Or whatever, I don't know. And it's... yeah, that's... Uh, yeah, that's... It definitely... Wait, it's so small! How's it gonna destroy Earth? It's so small compared to Earth, it I looked like. I to give you a taste of my revenge once all the seven Chaos Emeralds are collected. Oh, shit. Once I initiate this program, it cannot be disabled. Uh oh All of you ungrateful humans who took everything away from me yeah. will feel my loss. That's not good. And what is this he means? Is there anything else you want to say? No. Ready! What's going on here? I guess Who is that? he was going to get executed. I plan to give you a taste of my rage. The vibration's getting worse. No, Professor damn. Gerald Robotnik, one of the greatest scientific minds in the world, and my grandfather. Well, Dirk. What? I knew you were behind all this. Stop it right now, or else I'd have done this a long time ago if I had the chance. What do you mean? Done what? Crashed the ark into Earth? Or what? You're pretty persistent for a hedgehog, aren't you? Yep. Still alive. Huh? Just letting Knuckles pilot the shuttle all the way over here was more dangerous than you Probably, could ever actually. Like this. this is my grandfather's diary. It's one of those audio diary thingamajiggers. Cool, so I don't have to read it. I don't quite know what happened That's or Bruce's what job. went wrong. Was it a mistake to create the ultimate life form? I thought it would be something that would benefit mankind, but then the military guards landed Ambience. on the colony that day. They were sent to destroy the research project that I had been working on. My colleagues at the research facility, my granddaughter, Maria, I hope you are all And this safe. is what he wants to get revenge on. The call is completely shut down, probably to keep the prototype from falling into the wrong hands. Into the wrong hands. The art was shut down under the premise that there had been an accident. The military is trying to cover it up, like always. Awesome. I found Maria's Screw you, Eric. Eric. <laughs> She meant everything to uh -oh. me, and I couldn't bear the thought that she died because of my research. I lost everything. I had nothing more than What about your more. grandson, I Dan? All I could think about was to avenge her. Somehow, some way, I got scared as I no longer was able to control my thoughts. Yeah. Uh oh All I could think about, I wanted it all based on Suicidal. my original projections. I was able to complete my project, Shadow. Yeah. Uh -oh. I designed its mind to be perfect. But you failed. Pure. Pure? I everything to him. If you 
wish. Release and awaken it if to the world. If you to fill the world with destruction... I do! Oh, so oh, sorry. that's why you released Shadow from the base. The core of the Eclipse cannon is now highly reactive and exploded. Yeah, oh, that's not good. The chaos emerald is overpowered. If the colony collides with Earth, so it's Ubered. That mad scientist. That mad scientist. Oh, I've already said that. Yep. Wait. Eggman. You're going to help us save Earth. Or Mobius. Why? That's it. There is a way to stop the energy. Master Emerald. Oh yeah, I forgot that. That's right. If I use this, I just might be able to stop the Chaos Emerald. You know what you mean the Emeralds? There still may be some time left. If we pull together, we might be able to get to the shortcut that leads to the core. Victorious theme music. Awesome, and well, this is what the final story is gonna be. We're gonna have to work together to get to the main engine thingamajigger. Awesome. No worries, just leave it to me. I'm the world's fastest hedgehog. Then let's get to work. I love how Eggman said that. So yeah, the final level of the game is Cannon's Core. In this level, we have to play as every single blood stupid character. And if you die once, you lose all your points. You're gonna have- if you want to get an A rank, you're gonna have to do this whole thing without dying. And unfortunately, I forgot how to play the game since I haven't played so long. So I'm just gonna ignore that guy. Because I suck. And in this level, we have a special clock gimmick. Where you can press these clock and that'll freeze time for a little while, and oh god, it's perfect chaos. Yeah, this stage has the artificial chaos's enemies. Did I just die? Please tell me I did die. This stage has the artificial chaos enemies. And you guys know... How the hell did I just die? System alert. System alert. Oh well, at least I didn't. At least I just started over. Whatever. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. This stage has the artificial chaos enemies, and they're annoying as ever. But luckily, if you attack them when, when I could have sword, I didn't land on that, but whatever. And if you attack them while they're frozen with a space-time thingamajigger, then you can kill them. Oh shoot! I nearly. Oh, really? I, wow! I didn't know this could happen. Thank you. Whee! Yay! And now we have to save the world from Professor Gerald's fucking insanity. Because, well, Professor Gerald, Gerald turned completely bat crap insane. Isn't that just lovely? For once, insanity is a bad thing. I can't believe it. Why? Why insanity? Why have you betrayed me? Yeah, Whatever. So yeah, we have to save the world from Professor J. Arold's stupidity. I'm just gonna do- I can't ignore these dudes. Oh, boo. Boo-hoo. Whatever. And since there is a space-time thingamajigger, I'm just going to stop time because I am awesome. Ow, shoot! I got hit somehow. I don't know why or how. Why would I get hit? Why would you hit Tails? You're such a jerk, game. Why would you hit the Fox Boy? You jerks. Luigi, I just went this way for no particular reason at all. And now there's laser gates. Fan friggin' task. Wait. Never mind. Who needs lasers? And now for this part, you just want to. Repeatedly attack the gate, ignoring everything in your way, and just open the way so Eggman's part can go. And my computer turned off. Fantastic. Whatever. Whee! And this may look dark on the camera because this is fairly dark. 
It is Eggman's level, so it has to fit his dark personality or whatever. I'm just making crap up. Because that is how I roll. I just make everything up. And elevator music. Um, I can't think of any good elevator music, even though there probably is no good elevator music on the source of the world. So I'm just going to kill things, because Eggman likes to kill things, especially chaos. Even though... I hate the artificial chaos, by the way. Uh, we... And now Eggman is about to die because I suck at this game. Oh shoot! Crap nuggets. There was a lot of artificial chaos in the... I panicked. More or less. Damn it, that's not what I wanted. I'll shoot when I want to shoot. My god, this timer goes on forever. I hope this works. Shoot, please come up, please come up. Thank you, god. Um... Where am I going? Oh, I thought it was at the end. No, that'd be awesome. Anyway, let's just stop time because we're evil. Ow, I hit myself in the noggin because I suck. And checkpoint, get! Oh, crap, Kate! Slow down a bit. I don't care about fighting the artificial chaos thingamajiggers because I hate artificial chaos. Let's go this way, because this is probably the way we have to go, and let's kill the card official chaos. Because we can, and oh, this is fantastic. This is lucky. Lucky me, not lucky me, not lucky me, oh my god. Which way are we going? Fantastic. Not fantastic! Crap! I jumped too early. That sucks. We since we already know this how this is gonna go. Oh, la 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 That's the only theme I can think of. I should probably think of better themes to sing while I'm doing absolutely nothing, like... And I, oh, crap. Oh, I somehow killed them. I'll make the world pay for their insolence against Eggman. And let's just destroy the gate before we make even better fools of ourselves. And now it's time for, I believe, Rouge's part, which is my least favorite part. Yep, Chuck Tesco. It's Rouge's part of the level, which is my least favorite part because... Well, it's Rouge's part of the level. How do I control, control the camera? That's how. Fantastic. And yeah, Rouge's part has these really loud and obnoxious machines. Kinda like me. And once you put on the space-time rewind, you want to go through this waterfall because we're evil. And in this part you want to time it correctly. You want to time it correctly, which I have not. And if you don't time it correctly, then you're gonna have to wait for the stupid thing to run. Oh my god, did I time it correctly? I did. And in this one, you just want to hit that button right there. And then we want to get the hell out of here because, well, we don't want to stay around with artificial chaos. And unfortunately, you have to hit the space-time rewind switch, or whatever it's called. I don't know, the little chaos control switch. And then quickly get the hell out of there, because you don't have much time, and hit the button to release the water. Why are we releasing the floodgates? Um, because Eggman told us to, and this will help us somehow, and this brings us to Knuckles' part of the level. Yay! And wow, my commentary is complete crap. 
And in this part, this is why you wanted to get the air necklace. It is completely possible to defeat this part without the air necklace, because there are air bubbles here. It's just mm, kind of hard without it. Oh, and you don't want to hit hit the top. Oh, and guess what? Oh, where the hell am I going? I'm lost in space. Ow, shoot. In this part, we gotta time it. I think. Except now we're underwater, and that just makes everything a hell of a lot worse. I think this is the part we're supposed to go to. Please tell me this is the part we're supposed to go to. Please. I don't quite remember, sire. I don't... I think I just wasted my time. Yeah, now that I remember it, I think I wasted my time, everybody. I'm being stupid. I'm making stupid mistakes, dude. So let's go do what we're supposed to do. Because I'm stupid. Stupid. I am so stupid. That's where we're supposed to go, isn't it? Hey, what's this? A one up. Yay, those things. Uh, that would actually. This is actually very helpful because I suck at this level. We want to hit that switch, I think. Get past perfect chaos and into this level. This area and go up here and hit the switch here. And that'll deactivate those bars there. And now we can go past those bars. Awesome! Uh, where are them? There, there are them. Yes, English. Who needs proper English when you have water levels? Oh dear, perfect chaos in water. This is bad. As you can see, there's bubbles right there. Let's just hit the bomb to kill all the artificial chaos. And let's go through here. Oh no, we can't because the water is flowing too fast. So we need to find a space-time rewind switch. Which is right up here. And as soon as we hit it, we want to go. Very fast. Please, Knuckles, go very fast. Why can't you go faster, Knuckles? Move faster, Knuckles! Faster! Thank you. Ow. These lasers, they are not very friendly. Oh, Jesus. This is not very healthy for this echidna. Lasers are not healthy. I want my ring. Please. Mommy. Oh my god, I'm so scared. I have no rings. And I'm so scared. I have wing rings, so I'm not very much so scared. Damn it! I almost made it too. You have to be very fast. And you actually have to hit the switch. Duh! Knuckles, hit the switch. Thank you. Thank you, Knuckles, for not being an idiot. For once in your sad, pathetic life. And you want to hit the switch, because that'll be helpful. And as soon as we get over here, I think we're ending the level. Because we hit the switch, and that opens that door that allows Sonic to go through the door. Yes. And then we get to the final part of Cannon's Core. But do not fear, for there is more after this door. It is Sonic's level. I can't freaking think of anything else that rhymes. In this part, you want to hit the space-time rewind switch and hit all the perfect chaoses. You want to hit that one really quick because he'll summon a bunch of minions and cheap bottomless pit deaths are always, always, always fun. Don't you know? Again, we want to kill this guy really quickly before he sends out his evil minions after us and don't get tricked into death again because we're not stupid. We want to go from here. Oh, wait, that's right. I think we have to kill that chaos over here. Yeah, because once we kill this chaos, that'll open this door. Oh, shoot. Fudge! Why do you have to be such a pain in the arse? Perfect chaos. 
No, I mean artificial chaos. Ah! No, I hit you. You know it's true. I hit you. Nerdy do. Where the hell am I going? Nerdy do. I forgot I had this because I'm stupid and I'm a very forgetful little bean. I'm a bean? Yes, you are! No! Well, anyway. Hey, this looks kind of familiar. It, it it's kind of reminds me of Lost World. I God dang it. I friggin' forgot that you had to go up. God dang it. You trick me game. You and your deceptive lies and flattery are not going to freaking make me die today. Yes. For I am Sonic. I am going to die the most pathetic ways possible, because I'm stupid. I'm going to hit that guy this time. For great justice. For justice will prevail this time, game. Your deceptive ways won't stop me. We're at 20 minutes, game. Oh my god, don't make me die. Er, gotta get up. I think this is what we have to do, at least. And then, we go down. This looks very familiar. Oh my god, it almost reminds me of Lost World! No, really, this is like a recreation of the water slide in Lost World. I wonder what this is leading to. Next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, we're going to end Cannon's Core and finally stop Gerald's mad, stupid plan. On next, Dark Mario X, signing off. Have a fantastic day.